25.70. We had a track record in the uh, Trotters version. They're all set to go. The Pacers line up. And the green light is there. They're away. So off they go in the Tab.com Canberra Cup and pace initially from Topeka Lou. There's no one really challenging it for the time being. Morvar second. Murphy's reward on the outside as they go around that turn and then came Lightning Baby. Oh, we got a galloper and it is uh, Baxter Red who's broken up. The uh, free-legged pace has broken up there for Harry Ross on that first turn and it's uh, drifting back towards the end but it's pacing again as they go to the far side and Topeka Lou got a pretty soft lead. Second up in Australia and goes along sweetly for Brad Hewitt in front by about five over Lightning Baby running second. Now from the back of the field, Baxter Red, after making a mistake, is already on the move. It's moving around the outside and shortly will go up into the breeze, I'd say. Now further back is Carlo Gambino who's settling down fourth the inside, three back the pegs. Then Murphy's Reward being followed further back by Zambia who's back in company with Morvar towards the back of the field also is the talk. Behind those in turn to Dat Lovely and last of all is our Vinny, the favourite back in last yet to play its hand with two circuits remaining. It is Chipigalu, comes down the straight We'll have the lead time shortly with two circuits remaining to Peekaloo. So the two fancied runners, one's in front, one's back in last. That's our Vinny who sees them all out of the straight and to Peekaloo to the far side. Baxter Red already got a, a story to tell after galloping and then moving around the outside. It's Park second, the outer. And third, the leaders back there is Lightning Baby for Mikalev. Lead time, 112.3 into the far side they go. A little bit further back then to Carlo Gambino. Three back the inside from Murphy's Reward running fifth. One out, one back. The inside then came Zambia, who's centre field on the pegs. Then Morvar. It's in the running line up on the outside of the Torque. And further back in the field, Dat Lovely. And still Alvini is back in last. And there must be about 40 to 45 metres first to last as the field come up towards the turn. They've almost completed two laps. A 29.7 first quarter goes up on the board. And the ex-Kiwi, Topekaloo, one start in Australia was a win. It comes in the straight with the uh, bell sounding a circuit to go. Topekaloo for Brad Hewitt by four. Four. On its back there is Lightning Baby, the local. The outside backs to Red encouraged along. Here's Morvar pulling out. Then came Murphy's reward between runners as they go out of the straight. And now we can see Alvini who's starting to go forward now. And it's making a run on the back of Morvar. But it's probably going to have to come four deep, I'd say. That third, uh, second quarter in 28.9 in the Canberra Cup. They go to the far side. Having a look at Alvini. It is going out wide and starting to sprint up as they go down the far side. to Topekaloo still led by four over Lightning Baby and also Carlo Gambino who's running on well further back on the field Al Vinny's now moving around them three deep they run off the far side 30.2 the race on now to Peekaloo's been collared by Carlo Gambino and Pete McRae's got the front Al Vinny out of the pack goes up second and further back we got Zambia who's working into it strongly to Peekaloo can't go on as they come around the turn it's Carlo Gambino first into the straight but Zambia's on the scene about two metres away and still Al Vinny's about four metres off them Carlo Gambino Gambino and Zambia's diving on the outside in the Canberra Cup and won. Zambia beats Carlo Gambino followed by Alvini third. Further back in the field then we had Lightning Baby in the torque and behind those Topeka Lou that lovely then Baxter Red a little bit further back then Murphy's reward and Morvar is tailed out the back. It's a photo finish we stand by. <laughs>